Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. And how are you today? Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Here's the daily from Help You Along Your Way. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatever time it is for you. And welcome to the Daily Crumb with me, Winky Schneebeck, Mishaki Kwe. Your friendly, freaky ass, sweet grass, water, medicine woman. Also, Christiana Carr, Chris Carr, Sipstar. All this beautiful divine being right here. And welcome all you beautiful divine beings right here, too. Oh, how grows it with you? So, good news yesterday. See, did they, 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 see, I taped, I don't know, can you see it in there? I taped a little four leaf clover there. I'm trying to flatten it out, and I wanted to. Leaves fell off, so I taped it there. <laughs> Got my penny in my pocket, too. Anyway, some. Um... Oh. Little ache. Tired. Stress. Right? Body's got a lot of process. Whatever. Anyway, good news. Blood work came back. Doctor's office called me yesterday. Um said that the blood work was normal. So the other thing he was concerned about, which he didn't say, because I, I think he was trying not to get me upset. Right? Didn't want me to uh, be worried. So he didn't share all the concerns, or maybe I missed it. I don't know. Gastric intestinal thing. Anyway, I still got to take the antacid, and he still thinks that I had an, ul an ulcer. So, but we don't need to rush the ultrasound now. So we would have needed to hurry up the ultrasound if there was something that showed up in the blood work that he was suspecting. But that wasn't there. So So now if it takes two weeks to get the ultrasound, that's all right. And it's it's it isn't as a it's starting to feel a little better in there. So that's all right. It's just a stress, right? Stress does a number on your body and especially your digestive system right here. Mm -hmm. And I feel <laughs> I feel it. Oh. And you know when I was a kid, I don't know if that's that was my place to escape, right? I went to the bathroom. I did all my crying in the bathroom. Most people, they didn't see me cry. I had a friend for years. Years and years and years. And uh, she, she moved out to BC and she actually saw me crying. <laughs> it was the ex. Whatever. Oh my God, Christy, you do cry, is what she said. Yeah, I am a human being. But you know what? My tears didn't soften people. It made them attack me more. Not all people. And then those was ones closest to me. You know, that's where, whatever. They, they, they knew better than I did about me. I don't know. That's not the truth. Whatever. Anyways. Here we go. Here we go. I wanted to t take less time. That's why I just moved this over in front. So I'm trying to keep those short and sweet like me so they upload. I, I, I cleaned up my scooter and scooted up to the no-go. So I got the videos all uploaded yesterday. Look at that. Three of them flipped right over. Like that. In my hand. In my hand. So guess what we're doing? Mm-hmm. Here we grow. Start with the reflection on the top here. Okay. Your past does not define who you are today. Whoa. Gabriella Mergold Linze. Your past does not define who you are today. This is a 59. Be a five. Close your eyes and take 10 deep breaths. Ah. <sighs> Focus more on the out breath too. That's a very great tip that I learned at that chair yoga. Focus more on the out breath. The in breath will come. So close your eyes and take 10 deep breaths. With each inhale, breathe in calm and peace. With each breath out, let go of what came before. You are here now. And your path is in front of you. Let's do one big one together. In. And release out. <sighs> release fully. And then breathe back in. Focus on that breath. It is so powerful just to bring your awareness to your breath. That's one way to bring you right into the moment. Right here and now. Be here and now. Because you are here now. And that's enough. Okay. Affirmation. Keep good company, read good books, love good things, and cultivate soul and body as faithfully as you can. Still swinging. Uh -huh.
Uh, Louisa May Alcott. Oh, take 10 minutes out of your day to read. So number six. So that was earlier this week. Did Have you done that? Maybe today is the day. I don't know what is up for you. You know what I love? The pen to paper reading, uh, writing letters. Read or write a letter. Oh, I love letters. Love letters. Oh, I've written love letters. <laughs> That's my love. That's a little thing of mine since I was a kid. <laughs> Secret admirer. The one I told him, I finally told him it was me. And he laughed at me in the line and told everybody we're in the lineup to go back in for school. It was so embarrassing. Oh well. A Sylvie. They didn't stop me. That's why I love that. Love like you've never been hurt. Or, you know, love like you have been hurt. So you know how that feels. You're not going to pass that on, right? We don't carry the hurt. We just know that hurts. So I want to be honest and clear communications, no misunderstandings. I don't know. What is that for you? doesn't mean there's not going to be any misunderstandings, but we can clear those up. We don't take off on our misunderstanding. We go, oh, wait, I think I've misunderstanding. Or, hey, am I hearing this correctly? Am I understanding correctly? I don't know. What is that for you? Because who knows you better than you? Maybe the one that made you? Not even the ones that gave birth to you. Okay, they don't know you better than you. Okay? I don't know my children better than they do. Maybe as they're younger, but as they grow up, I mean, my eldest, he knows himself better. He knows why he makes the choices he did. And I'll always be here with him. I miss my granddaughter's birthday also on Mother's Day Sunday. She'll be three and I still have not met her. The universe wove you from a constellation just so. Every atom, every fiber in you comes from a different star. Reconnect with the creative influences. Oh, that's by Nikita Gill. Reconnect with the creative influences you have been drawn to throughout your life and how they have affected the person you have become. That's a 30, which is a three. That's a self-expression. What are those things that you're most drawn to when you're alone? My dancing, singing, writing. All those kinds of things. What the things where you were connected to? All right. What were those things that you were connected to? And how can you reconnect with that? Today, right? Reconnect. The creative fluences. Creative fluences. Right? Okay. Can, there you go. Maybe it'd do better to read that on your own. <laughs> I already read it. I already read it three once. <laughs> uh, okay, Padre Totem. Let's put that back here. Padre Totem going along. I eight now. Oh my goodness. I wanted to make it shorter. And there we go. There's a path. Where's the totem with the totem right there? There we go. I got the path on the bottom and the path on the top. Oh, here we go. Here we go. That's roots and giving. What, what, are, what kind of root? What are your roots giving you? Are there rotten roots? You got some root rot in there? Oh, no, we need to clear those out, hey, don't we? I don't know. Look for that joy, right? Tap into that joy inside, right? And that's that inner peace. We we'll keep that inner peace and that calm inside, right? <gasps> Bunny! Bunny outside. Can I switch it? Can you see it? Oh. Oh, no, it just went by my bed. Sorry. There was a rabbit. There was a funny rabbit. It was just hopping by my bed there. Okay. Okay, where am I at? Okay. I'm here right now, and that is enough. Uh, 30 firemen. That passion. What was that? What is that passion? That spontaneity. Okay, it's something. Okay, reconnect. It is time to reconnect. Hmm. What is that for you? What is it? Your heart calling you to reconnect to? Maybe it's a who. I know, and that's the three, the weasel, the stealthy. There's stuff happening behind the scenes, right? We get those promptings, that internal timing. What is that? It's time to celebrate. It's that quickening. The time has come. That's the law. Ah, oh, all the truth will come out. Oh, he's right there. Oh, he's right there. I got to take the time. Love you all. Let's see the bunny. Let's see the bunny. It's the joy, overcoming those fears. Okay, can you see? Can you see? Let's see. I got to turn it this way. Can you see the bunny in me driveway? Over there, over there. I can't. I can't change the uh, screen from here. You see him? I hope him or her, whatever. 
can you see the bunny? I can